everyone and welcome to week one day two of summer steam today we're going to show you how to make a paper pinwheel this activity you will need one ruler one glue stick one push pin one pencil and one piece of paper in your shoe boxes you'll find three pieces of paper so if you want to decorate one or if you want to try it again you can do that so the first thing we're going to do is going to take one piece of paper and we're going to fold it into a triangle we're going to try to line up the edges as nicely as you can but it's okay if it's a little off Go ahead and press down firmly on that crease to make sure it is crisp. We're gonna unfold it and we're gonna fold it the other way to make another triangle. Make sure it's lined up nicely and press down really hard on the edges to make sure it is crisp. So now we'll have a piece of paper with an X in the middle. So the X actually indicates the center of the paper. We're gonna go ahead and make a dot right where the lines meet. We're gonna take a ruler and we're gonna measure out one centimeter away from the dot on the X toward the end of the paper. And we're gonna do that for all four lines. Remember, one centimeter. Once you measure those one centimeter marks, you're gonna take your pair of scissors and you're gonna cut along the X toward the dots. And you're gonna stop when you hit the one centimeter mark. So we're not gonna cut all the way into the center, we're just gonna cut until we hit that one centimeter away mark. And we're gonna do that for all four edges. So when you're done, it should look like a little floppy paper. And what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna take our glue stick and we're gonna just put a little glue right in the middle of that paper, just so it'll stick a little better. And we're gonna take one of the little floppy edges and we're gonna fold it toward the center of the paper. You want to make sure you press it down really hard. The thing to remember is not to press the paper all the way down, just the tip. So we're going to fold every other point. We're going to count off one, two, and fold the next point, the one that's two. We're going to go ahead and add more glue to make sure that it keeps sticking, but remember, it's every other one. It's okay if it comes a little off. Just make sure to put on more glue and keep sticking it on there. If you find that it's really coming undone, Go ahead and press it down for a little bit. And once you fold it four corners, you're gonna let the glue dry. Once the glue dries, we're gonna find the center of that pinwheel and we're gonna take our push pin and we're gonna poke a hole through the center of the paper. So if you're holding it like this, be careful not to poke your fingers. If you need to, you can ask a trusted adult to help you with this. We're gonna poke it right through the paper in the middle. Then we're gonna take our pencil and we're gonna push the sharp end of that push pin into the eraser, into the side of the eraser, not on top, but the side. So it should look something like that. And now you can watch it spin.